uh, Tank Girl. Yeah, Tank Girl. Uh, Lori that's Petty. Lori Petty. Petty. Lori yeah. Petty. That's Lori but Petty. Who she dated? She looks like young Lovely. Annie Potts. It's weird. Yeah. Lori Petty also dated. Um, why am I blanking on his name? Negro Damas. Um, oh, uh, Paul Mooney. Paul yeah, Mooney. Yeah. They were in a relationship, which is very weird. Our next but uh, Greg yeah, Edwards also tells game. me that uh, Paul Mooney's gay, so I don't know. Called microfiche. I don't. I, don't, I think that, that would make me so much happier. Some gay. somehow like bye. Yeah. Well, a little if, gay. Like I love Paul Mooney, but there are times when I'm listening to Paul Mooney where I'm like. He's not talking about me, white people. Is he? He just, Paul <laughs> Mooney, I think, is just one of those guys who jerks off to himself in the mirror. He's like, "Oh, you handsome. Oh, you're so handsome. Oh, you handsome. Oh, you Don't got a good much. face. White people take it from you. You got to get a good face. Got a good face. Got a good dick. Got a good dick. <laughs> good face. Good dick. Mmm. Good face. Good dick. That's how Paul Mooney jerks off in my mind. But he's like a mirror. He lays in his bed and he has silk sheets. They're red silk sheets, and he has a mirror above his bed that he just looks up at himself. And the walls sprawled out, plastered with the No, I just thought about it a lot. That's that's pretty accurate. Dead on. I'm like, yeah, that's exactly what I would think. He just lives, and he also lives in um, the El Pacino's apartment in Devil's Advocate. (laughs) We're back. Perfect. That's a great one. Um, There's no bedroom in that because he doesn't sleep. Mm-mm. So that, that was what? The what is he a vampire? To, uh, God, he's a vampire. Devil he's the vampire. devil vampire. <laughs> devil vampire. <laughs> I can only get by by sucking the blood of other devils. Did you see these paintings I got from Super Mario World? <laughs> they move. <laughs> so, um, the way Mario sixty four, by the way. Oh yeah, that's right. uh, the Sorry. Um, the way we play this uh, game, the microfiche game, the brand new game that uh, we just invented, is very simple. Justin, give us the microfiche. Oh shit! Give us, give us microfiche. Microfiche. Give us the microfiche. Like tiny fish. Like, like what a microfiche is. This. No, give it to me. Give me the microfiche. Okay, here you go. Okay, that is how we played <laughs> the microfiche game. Yeah. <laughs> what? The idea behind that one is, is you were supposed to hold out, and then we were going to. Uh, oh, sorry. Spy, play spies, but that's okay. I thought you were asking about microfiche, man. No, like, what is microfiche? Uh, What's a microfiche? But that's a better game. What is microfiche? Two definitions. Minnows in a bucket, uh-huh. or uh, a re- like the internet in film. Yeah, <laughs> gotcha. Just scrolling, 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 scrolling. I understand it now. I am glad that you gave it to me. For it's a very important in uh, the fugitive. Uh, and people use it for like, well, people used to use it for research in yeah. college. And I, like, the only thing that I would ever do with a microfiche machine, I'd be like, Dateline, nineteen thirty-nine. The sports teams are doing very well, and I would never stop it. Because yeah. I was like, I cannot invent something that will spin a paper, but I can just turn this wheel all the way. Yeah. Everything's fine. Yeah, exactly. Love microfiche. Germans of age. 